Is this the worst trade in WNBA history? Well, I think it's the only trade in WNBA history that we're talking about. And player Brittany Griner was hating on her own team that is the United States of America. And she was shitting all over it. And then decided that she thought she was bigger than another country. Went to Russia and brought some drugs. Well, that backfired on you, didn't it? Because they signed you to a max nine-year contract in a Russian prison and you cried poor and said, America, save me. And they ended up doing it, which was very lucky for you. But it came about in the worst trade ever. They ended up trading Brittany for someone that is nicknamed the Merchant of Death. Now, if you're a UFC fighter or a boxer or even a pro wrestler, that is an awesome nickname. But when you're a real life criminal, that is a terrible nickname to be traded for. Russia has certainly won the deals on that one and they didn't even have to give up any first rounders. It was like trading Steph Curry for the bloke at the local YMCA Division 4. America got shafted on that trade. But I hope the next time there's a WNBA game, Brittany Griner is just hitting the high seas when the anthem is playing. But going back to sports, it is all in a bit of fun. So let me know what you think the worst sport trade is ever. There have been some absolute shockers in the world of sport, including this one that we're talking about now. And if you can, like, share and subscribe. Everything that is Aussie calls it, you dead set legends. And I'll see you next time.